Sudanese people living in Ingala, South Darfur state capital, are expressing mixed opinions over Darfur's pro-army governor, Mini Minawi's call for citizens to take up arms to defend their property. It comes as fighting fled again despite the latest ceasefire pledges of the two warring generals. Calling citizens to take up arms is a very dangerous call that will have dire consequences and may lead to civil war. It is an irresponsible call. I totally reject this idea. It might have hidden reasons or goals in the future. It might turn into a civil war or personal conflict. In addition, it may cause fear or terror for their families and children. Also, arming people isn't regulated, and we don't know what kind of weapons will be used and where people will be trained. This is very dangerous. In Darfur, already ravaged by a deadly war in the 2000s, local militias, tribal fighters and armed civilians have joined the fighting. Arming people is very important. Most of Sudanese are trained in camps and know how to handle weapons, but now the situation is very difficult. It is an unbearable situation. If armed people attack you and you are not armed, you won't be able to defend yourself. So if we do not find a way to arm people, the losses will be great. Many Sudanese now fear an all-out civil war, according to the forces for freedom and change, the civilian and bloc ousted from power in the 2021 coup led by the two generals who were then allies but now are at war.